Rodeo brings people together across the country, and it serves as the basis for one of the most unique relationships on the pro circuit. Tom Wiley tells us about the cowboy and the trick rider, a love story. She is from Oklahoma. She is Haley Genzel. So I've been performing since I was five. Um, my uncle is the four-time NFR Specialty Act, and he's retired now, but I get to carry on a family tradition. Haley Gansel thrills crowds across the country with her horses, Jiminy, and Cricket. I'm getting to live out a dream I've had since I was a little kid, and I owe it all to my horses back here because they're the hard workers, so they do more out there than I do. Lately, she's been able to live out another dream in the arena, working alongside her fiancé, who's pretty successful in his own right. <laughs> Shane Proctor is a former Montana State Bull Rider and the 2011 PRCA World Champion. He's one of the most decorated cowboys in the world, but during Haley's act, he's just happy to blend in. Through the ring of fire we go! I know that act in and out. I've, I've got to do it several hundred times now, and uh, so I can I can pretty much know where at in, in her act and that everything needs to go. And, and last year at Pendleton, I got bucked off my bronc. No time to be mad. I walked over, shaps on and everything, and started setting her stuff up. The support I can show her is by helping her and making sure everything goes right. I just wanted to, I want her acts to be something special. I get more nervous for her than I, she does for me or. Uh. He actually, um, I was joking around with some people ago, he stresses out when I'm not ready. He wants everything done and taken care of and he will have things taken care of before I even get around to it. So I kind of get spoiled when he's with me. Now Shane is still a working cowboy. He retired from the PBR last year to chase a PRCA all around title while Haley takes her act to different rodeos each week but the two have made the crazy schedule work. We just know that, you know, this is our dream and we can't do it forever. And so I support him and he supports me. And, and it's fun when you get to be out there with your best friend too, and, and we get to do it together. And oh, I always try to make sure and enter at least the rodeos that she's working at so I can see her. You do go two, three weeks sometimes and, and all you get to do is talk on the phone, but- FaceTime. Lots of fa <laughs> lots of FaceTime. <laughs> the miles, the phone calls, the busy schedules are all worth it and it will make the next phase in their life worth savoring. And eventually it will slow down. Eventually, you know, it's, eventually we will start a family and we will, uh, you know, we won't have any rodeos that we have to go to until our kids are rodeoing. And uh, so right now we have the opportunity to travel and do everything that we want and, and uh, we're very blessed with that. Tom Wiley, MTN Sports. Shane and Haley will tie the knot on October 5th in Oklahoma, the week after the 2019 rodeo season ends.